My name is uh, Antonio R. Tobias. You know, son, uh, I know from what the group has gone through, there is really need for, uh, for reforming, reforming the person because, you know, what, uh, what you have been asked uh, to do before is really against the very, the, the very person itself. So you destroy a person. Uh, if you were to continue longer than that, you will destroy him and go and go to, you can go as far as insanity. I hope there is no, none of, that, uh, of those uh, members that uh, have gone that far. But from my own experience and contact with, uh, there is a lot of woundedness. And uh, you are being asked to do something that uh, is very much against your will, but you cannot do uh, anything because you are bound by so-called obedience. And so uh, that is how the person is destroyed, you know? And uh, that is what I notice with, uh, with the community. Thank God that uh, when the, the um, how you call the uh, pontifical commissariat came in, I think it was just on time. It was still, uh, it was still, we can still uh, redirect, no? But uh, the wound is there already. And only time is going to go and tell also huh, how, how, how deep is that wound and how successful were we to, to draw persons, the people, out of those uh, things. And I think this is also that where at least the, the oath with the process retreat that they have gone through are going. There is a team of, uh, of uh, priests and lay that uh, is looking at the human formation and how the person is uh, uh, coping up. And I think, uh, I don't know, I, it's hard to say it's successful, but uh, we're doing our best. That's the most important thing. Now, I have asked the different uh, institutes to have a rescue operation of those that were former. That was one of our own topics of our own meeting. And I was told that they, uh, they, they meet with those who are, uh, uh, who have been, who are already out. But that's a very good thing that you are, you are doing that. I don't know what inspired me, but I think I felt that yung mga who left, they were good persons. No? They were really good persons like you were, because of, because uh, of mishandled formation, we lose you. And that is my, my real concern. And uh, in, napakahalaga sa mga OIC also uh, that, uh, that, you know, you have to handle where your own uh, people handle. And that is something because uh, uh, if you mishandle, it will be for life, even in now the, the way uh, you say things can really affect a person uh, deeply, and that is why. Okay, the ex-members, I really want to meet with you. Long time ago, I wanted that because there were still, I feel that uh, I felt, and I still do feel now, that there are uh, persons that could be rescued. Rescued, I do not know if rescued go back to, to, to religious life and uh, to priesthood or uh, to any, but uh, uh, rescued in the sense that you are a whole person. That is what is important. 
whether you are going to become a priest or a religious or a, to me it's not important that you are a whole person and that you still uh, 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 is in control of your own of your own self and you have a good image of your own self that's important huh? so keep that up no and uh, your uh, experience do not allow that the, your experience of the past would block you out from because that would make you forever uh, a prisoner of your own past. So that's it. No, I don't know if that will help, but I I hope we could uh, feel free, uh, feel free to contact anyone uh, or who are still there in the. Uh, and even those that have left have some uh, because you were so many before I like that the, uh, there should be a parabagang a, uh, an association or a club that, uh, by which you will be able to help each other Lord we ask you to bless our uh, communities the six communities founded by Father Bing we ask you to bless also Father Being, enlighten him with the, with the, with the enlightenment of the Spirit, that uh, our uh, effort should really to build up the church, the body of Christ, and that uh, uh, that uh, he allows himself to be under the 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 guidance of. Uh, the bishops and uh, our church. So also bless our Lord those that have left. Give them a good future. Help them to find themselves and build up a future that is going to be um, good and really a blessing for them. For those who have stayed, uh, bless them also because uh, they are, while they may be in a better situation now, help them to be generous of themselves so that they are able to help and build the church that, that Christ has loved and we also love. We ask this through Christ our Lord. Amen.